we're going to look at the pH of a number of buffer solutions and see how the pH changes as we add acid or base. We're going to start out, however, looking at a solution that is not a buffer, which is pure water. I've calibrated a CBL pH probe and I'm going to put it into some distilled water. Our solution starts out being relatively close to a pH of 7. We're going to add a drop of one molar HCl. Notice that the pH drops rapidly. Pure water is not a buffer. If we add a strong acid to it, the strong acid ionizes 100 percent. There's no buffering capacity in the water. The pH drops rapidly. We'll repeat this experiment with some more distilled water. Notice that the starting pH here is a little bit less than 7. This is not unusual if there's a lot of dissolved carbon dioxide in the water, which forms carbonic acid. What we're going to do is add a drop of one molar NaOH to the solution. Notice that the pH rises rapidly to a pH of almost of greater than 12. Pure water, again, is not a very good buffer. If we add a strong base, the, ra the pH rises rapidly.